Welcome to ReneeEnergy.com on YouTube, the hub for all things renewable energy and sustainability. Our channel is dedicated to bringing you the latest innovations and insights in green energy, including cutting-edge developments like green hydrogen. Whether you're a sustainability veteran or just beginning your journey, we have something for everyone. Join us on this channel to explore inspiring projects for a sustainable tomorrow. We bring you the latest in renewable energy, sustainability, and cutting-edge technologies. And don't forget, for more in-depth information and resources, visit our website and subscribe to our newsletter for the latest updates and exclusive content. Hello and welcome to ReneeEnergy.com's YouTube channel. In this video, we'll be diving deep into the world of hydrogen fuel cell trains and exploring their performance and efficiency compared to traditional diesel and electric trains. As the demand for sustainable transportation solutions grows, hydrogen fuel cell technology has emerged as a promising alternative, offering a cleaner and more efficient way to power trains. So, let's get started. First, let's talk about energy efficiency. Hydrogen fuel cell trains have a distinct advantage over diesel trains when it comes to converting energy. Fuel cells work by directly converting the chemical energy stored in hydrogen into electrical energy, without the need for combustion. This process can achieve an impressive efficiency of up to 60%, while diesel engines typically operate at around 30-35% to efficiency. That's a significant difference, and it means that hydrogen trains can make better use of the energy they carry on board. However, it's important to note that the overall efficiency of hydrogen trains depends on more than just the fuel cell itself. We also need to consider the efficiency of the entire hydrogen supply chain, including production, distribution, and storage. Currently, most hydrogen is produced from natural gas through a process called steam methane reforming, which does result in some carbon emissions. But as the shift towards renewable energy continues, we can expect to see more hydrogen being produced through electrolysis, using clean electricity to split water into hydrogen and oxygen. This green hydrogen will further improve the environmental benefits of hydrogen trains. Now, let's compare hydrogen trains to electric trains. Electric trains, especially those powered by renewable energy sources, can have a higher overall energy efficiency than hydrogen trains. This is because they have fewer energy conversion steps, the electricity goes directly from the grid to the train's motors. With hydrogen trains, there's an additional step of converting electricity into hydrogen and then back into electricity in the fuel cell. However, hydrogen trains have a key advantage when it comes to range and flexibility. Which brings us to our next point, range and refueling. One of the biggest benefits of hydrogen fuel cell trains is that they can achieve ranges similar to diesel trains, typically between 600 and 1000 kilometers on a single refueling. This makes them well suited for long distance routes where electrification infrastructure may not be feasible or cost effective. The range of a hydrogen train depends on several factors, such as the size of the hydrogen storage tanks, the power output of the fuel cell, and the train's operating conditions. Another advantage of hydrogen trains is their quick refueling time. While battery electric trains require lengthy charging sessions, a hydrogen train can be refueled in just 15 to 20 minutes. This fast turnaround helps to keep trains in service for longer periods, reducing downtime and increasing operational flexibility. It's a significant consideration for rail operators looking to maximize the utilization of their fleet. But to truly understand the performance of hydrogen fuel cell trains, we need to look at the factors that affect the fuel cell itself. Temperature plays a crucial role, fuel cells perform best within a specific temperature range, typically between 60 and 80 degrees Celsius. Extreme temperatures, either too hot or too cold, can reduce efficiency and cause degradation over time. That's why proper thermal management is essential, using efficient cooling systems to keep the fuel cell operating at its optimal temperature. Humidity is another important factor. Fuel cells rely on a delicate balance of moisture to function properly. Too little humidity can dry out the fuel cell membrane, while too much can flood it, impairing ion transport and reducing efficiency. Maintaining the right level of humidity is crucial for ensuring consistent performance and longevity. Fuel cells are also sensitive to impurities in the hydrogen fuel or air supply. Contaminants can poison the fuel cell catalyst, leading to degraded performance over time. This highlights the importance of using high-quality filters to remove any impurities before they reach the fuel cell stack. Another challenge faced by fuel cells is load cycling, that is, frequent changes in power demand. Every time the train accelerates or decelerates, the fuel cell needs to adjust its output accordingly. These constant fluctuations can put stress on the fuel cell components and accelerate degradation. 
hybrid systems that combine fuel cells with batteries or supercapacitors can help to mitigate this issue by handling the peak power demands and allowing the fuel cell to operate at a more consistent output. Of course, like any technology, fuel cells are subject to aging and wear over time. As the fuel cell racks up operating hours, the catalyst and other components will gradually degrade, leading to a natural decline in performance. This is where predictive maintenance comes into play. By monitoring key performance parameters and using data analytics, engineers can schedule maintenance tasks proactively, minimizing downtime and extending the fuel cell's lifespan. So, what can be done to optimize fuel cell performance in hydrogen trains? There are several strategies that engineers and researchers are exploring. Effective thermal management, as we mentioned earlier, is essential for maintaining optimal operating temperatures and minimizing thermal stress on the fuel cell. Humidity control techniques, such as using humidifiers or moisture-retaining membranes, can help to ensure proper hydration of the fuel cell. Air and fuel filtration systems play a critical role in preventing contamination and ensuring the purity of the hydrogen supply. The use of high-quality filters can significantly extend the life of the fuel cell stack. Hybrid systems, combining fuel cells with batteries or supercapacitors, offer another avenue for optimization. By using the battery or supercapacitor to handle peak power demands, the fuel cell can operate at a more steady state, reducing stress and improving efficiency. This approach also allows for regenerative braking, where the energy generated during braking can be captured and used to recharge the battery or even produce hydrogen through electrolysis. Predictive maintenance, as we discussed earlier, is a powerful tool for optimizing fuel cell performance. By continuously monitoring key parameters such as voltage, current, temperature, and humidity, engineers can detect early signs of degradation and schedule maintenance tasks before failures occur. This proactive approach helps to minimize downtime, extend the fuel cell's lifespan, and reduce overall maintenance costs. Looking to the future, there are several exciting developments on the horizon for hydrogen fuel cell trains. As hydrogen production technologies continue to advance and the use of renewable energy increases, we can expect to see improvements in the well-to-will efficiency of hydrogen trains. The development of more efficient and durable fuel cell materials, such as high-temperature proton exchange membrane (HIT PEM) fuel cells, could further enhance the performance and longevity of these systems. Researchers are also exploring advanced hydrogen storage technologies, such as metal hydrides or chemical carriers, which could increase the energy density and range of hydrogen trains. These innovations have the potential to make hydrogen trains even more competitive with traditional diesel and electric alternatives. In conclusion, hydrogen fuel cell trains offer a promising solution for sustainable rail transportation. While they currently have a higher tank-to-wheel efficiency than diesel trains, their overall well-to-wheel efficiency depends on the entire hydrogen supply chain. Compared to electric trains, hydrogen trains may have lower efficiency due to additional energy conversion steps, but they offer greater flexibility in terms of range and refueling time. The performance and efficiency of hydrogen fuel cell trains are influenced by various factors, including temperature, humidity, impurities, load cycling, and age. By implementing optimization strategies such as effective thermal and humidity management, hybrid systems, predictive maintenance, and regenerative braking, engineers can enhance the performance and extend the lifespan of these systems. As hydrogen technologies continue to evolve, we can expect to see further improvements in the efficiency, durability, and range of hydrogen fuel cell trains. With ongoing research and development, hydrogen trains have the potential to play a significant role in decarbonizing the rail industry and contributing to a more sustainable future. Thank you for watching this ReneEnergy.com's video on the performance and efficiency of hydrogen fuel cell trains. We hope you found it informative and insightful. If you enjoyed this content, please like, share, and subscribe to our channel for more videos on renewable energy and sustainable technologies. Until next time, stay curious and keep exploring the exciting world of clean energy. Thanks for tuning into the ReneEnergy.com YouTube channel. We trust you found this episode enlightening and motivating. There's a world of innovation and opportunity in sustainable energy, and we're delighted to share this journey with you. Stay in the loop with the latest on renewable energy and sustainability by visiting our website and subscribing to our newsletter. Your support is immensely appreciated, it's truly invaluable to us. Don't miss our next video on new trends in renewable energy. Follow us on social media for the latest updates. Enjoy the video? Like, subscribe, and share for more green insights. Thanks for watching.